You know, it's it's a difficult thing being the king in charge of all this stuff. But you want to know something? We got some other kings in mind right now Ooh. who are taking care of some kingdoms, I hear. <laughs> and I'm not talking about Game of Thrones, Raul. I'm talking oh. about the kingdom of the planet of the apes. Kingdom of the Crystal has been Skull? Announced. No. The... <laughs> we okay. don't talk about that one. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> So Doesn't for exist. those of you who couldn't tell, we are segueing into our next topic here. We got uh, Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes has been announced. Raul, read to us our, our Hollywood Reporter uh, yeah. quote here of the day. So this just came out, what, a couple years ago? I mean, a couple years ago, a couple days ago. Um, yeah, Hollywood Reporter saying that the next Planet of the Apes movie is coming into focus with 20th Century Studios confirming the cast of the newly titled Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes. The film from director Wes Ball uh, will star... Owen Teague alongside newly announced cast members Freya Allen and Peter Macon. Um, it is slated for a 2024 release. Yeah, so we got our fourth film in the Apes universe. Um, so, so are we not getting, uh, what's his face, Andy Serkis back? Andy, sir, have you not seen War for the Planet oh, of the Apes? Oh, crap. He dies, right? Does he die? Spoilers, guys. Spoilers. I don't, I don't, I don't know. You haven't confirmed it. <laughs> um, what are you, Zazlav? <laughs> Come on. Um, yeah. Uh, spoilers for war. Okay, spoilers for war for the Planet of the Apes, guys. Uh, <laughs> Caesar does in fact die um, at the end of the film. At he the had end way of too film. much Caesar salad. Uh, choked <laughs> on just, his Caesar salad. He ate himself to death like uh, like the guy in in Seven. Um, oh. So so anyway, so yes, he's not coming back. Box. But there is uh, the, uh, who is it? I think Owen T. Who's the I'll be honest, I don't know who Owen Teague is, but... I don't know I don't know who they are either, but I think Owen Teague might be the one who is said to play the lead ape in this movie, the lead the lead star. Oh, uh, I believe okay. it's which one of these guys. And maybe... But anyway, it's an, it's going to focus on a new uh, ape leader. <laughs> uh, not He might be playing uh, Caesar's son, who we saw at the, uh, uh, at the end of uh, the last movie. So it looks like this is going to be kind of a new era, a new quite literally in the in the universe it says it takes place a few years later right um, yeah also let me just say i yeah. i have seen the the trilogy that matt reeves was working on except for that first one because that's not what he worked on but i have seen all three movies but I, I, I just don't remember them. I got to rewatch them before. They're this great. Movie comes out. I love the Apes films. I think mm -hmm. um all I love the the especially these this new trilogy, this new uh, wave of films that that uh, have has come out, starting with Rise of the Planet uh, Planet of the Apes. My favorite of all three is still Dawn of the Planet of the Apes. That's uh, Matt Reeves is. Uh, Matt Reeves' debut in that in that series, and good lord, that's a great one. Um, but yeah, this is uh, this seems to be kind of like a new a new stage in the in the series, uh, new era, focusing on new characters. Uh, I'm just assuming for now, until they say otherwise, that this new lead ape character is probably Caesar's son, all grown up, and we're gonna see. We're getting close to because this doesn't necessarily contradict everything, anything that happens in the very first 1960s Planet of the Apes. Mm. Um, so we might be getting closer and closer to the situation that ends up being uh, in that very first one in the 60s. Would you so, want to see that, Raul? Like if that if that movie were to come out, like, would you be excited for it? Would you be like, ah, like we've already seen this already? Maybe. I mean, they, they might. It, who knows? It depends on where they want to go with this. Will they will they end right before the the 1960s one or will oh. they actually continue and remake the 1960s one? You know, they're yeah. essentially essentially saying that the very original 1960s Planet of the Apes is uh, is not part of this universe. Yeah. Well, also, um, technically, there is already a remake of that movie. Right? I mean, wasn't there one in the 2000s yes, with the Matt Tim Damon? Burton, it was the Tim Burton 2000, yeah. 2001 remake, which is not... <laughs> yeah, I, I heard it wasn't good either. I, yeah, Mocky Mock, yeah. Oh, so we got a Planet Full of Apes here? What are <laughs> oh, we doing? Oh, I what, thought it was Matt Damon. What's going on? That's how long it's been since I've seen that movie. That yeah, was Mark oh Wahlberg. Yeah. What are you doing? So you like a walking, talking ape, huh? What are we doing get, there? Get your hand, damn, what's, dirty what's hands going on? on me. I don't understand what you're doing. Uh, anyway. Also, I, I just saw Father Stew with Mark Wahlberg in it, and that man is phenomenal in that movie. Um, oh, but it? no, it, it's very good. We'll talk about it afterwards. But uh, I, I think I, I do see myself seeing them making a new version of the movie because I think based on everything they've learned with all the you know CGI work and technology that they've got now, um, I'm pretty sure if that they if they made a remake of Planet of the Apes, it'd be like the Avengers type of level of excitement for everybody if we mm. finally got to that point yeah. um, because now you've seen 
all these extra movies before the actual event happened, so you're building up to it. So mm-hmm. it it's almost a no brainer. Like they got they're gonna make so much money off of that if they can make that work. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I'm excited for it. I can't wait to see what it's gonna be we'll like. See, um, we'll see. I'm not again. Yeah. I've I've heard people say like, oh no, we don't need any more of these Abe's films. I'm like, yeah, hey, bring it on. I don't know. But I'm I'm not so precious about it that I'm like, oh no, why are they gonna keep going? You're gonna ruin it. If it's good, if the script's good, if the directors and the actors are all good, I'm all for it. Even if it's an hour and a half, we'll still enjoy it if it's a good <laughs> story. Right. You know? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. But three lackluster fight scenes, not two, all right? Jesus. <laughs> but I think 2024, I, I think that'll be pretty good. Um, if it if I had to choose between watching Brilliant and then this one, I'd probably go watch Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes. So, yeah. ugh, you guys doing this Will Smith movie, you better time it right if you want me to go watch it right now. <laughs> but uh, anyways, any, any last thoughts on this one before we go to our next topic? No, we'll just, uh, I'll wait to see what, you know, we'll pay attention to more developments on this movie as it goes on. But so far, I'm like, yeah, sure, another Planet of the Apes movie, great. I like all the other ones. 